Thursday special. Today we're hitting a modern to play one of my favorite decks in the format. Uh, so Team Escape Shift or Rug Shift got a brand new card called Joint Exploration. I'm not yet, I have not yet played this card in the actual list. It's kind of out of the perfect timing. So let's see, let's see this deck, All right? So the, the key fundamental pieces, we have Spiral, Exploration, we have Dryad, Brin, and then we have uh, some card advantage pieces, but we end it with Scape Shift. We're trying to dig for it um, and play extra lands as fast as we can to ramp into the combo kill. Now, land-wise, I mean, we don't run as many of the mountains as a normal list. So three, three, and like three, I think. Like there's like nine, ten mountains. Normally in Titan Ship, we play a lot more than that. Now, let's break down the key fundamental pieces of the sideboard. We have two chalices for the Cascade matchup. Also, decent against Burn. We have one more dress down for the um, uh, construct, Constructs. A couple Endurances for Graveyard Hate. Good against Murktide. We have a couple Engineer Explosives. Also pretty decent against um, the Rhinos, as well as the Constructs. A couple Mythical Disputes for Control. A natural state for hammer time and a couple more three more three veil of summers also for control so no further ado let's see teamer scape shift in action action hello it's your host cab bg don't forget to subscribe hit that like button also the bell notifications don't forget to check out the sweet stuff that's down in the description down below uh, lead off with the catcher triumph go Aaron Mason Plains, Giver of Runes, Passes, Scalding Tarn, Crack the Tarn, Get the Stomping Ground, seems fine. Play Wren, Uptick the Wren, Pass the Turn. Okay, he has no other land. All right, um, play, I guess, Valgut, Uptick Wren, Pass the Turn. Urza Saga for the opponent, Thalia. So we fire the giver. Spresh of iteration. Scalding tarn. Crack the tarn. Let's get a island. Uptick. Scal get back the scalding tarn. Spress of iteration. Spress of iteration in hand. Oh, they're back. I don't really need dress down in this matchup, so pass. Stoneforge Mystic. Correction, though, I probably could have used Dress Down since he does play Urza Saga, but it appears that he's not going to be able to get Constructs out of this thing. Hits us after getting a Calder complete. Oh, hits Ren. Never mind. Play Dryad. Bolt the board. Uptick. Cancel. Crack. Tarn. Get me a Reading Pool. Untapped. Face. Face. Uptick. Get back Tarn. Passenger. We're both tied to 13. Gets either vile. Is, that's kind of too late, right? We get to play double tarn? Yeah, that just, that's over. <laughs> okay, so against death and taxes, we could bring in probably these. Uh, dress down's probably not as good just because uh, the EE also takes care of the construct tokens and maybe go down a couple remands and a joint aspiration. I don't like that. Firing Vantage for the opponent. Vile. Passes. Triome. Go. This EE is probably a little worse now. I have to put on one. Thalia. Sure. Stomping Grounds tapped. Go. We got a lot of EIs in hand. Vile's end. Give her runes. Yep. Hits us. Down to 18. Crack the Tarn. Get an island. EE on one. How does this work? That, that tax effect does, does nothing against? Okay. Engineer supposed to, I was expecting to pay another one. All right. Seems good. Pass the turn. Goes to combat. Hits us. Hits us. Down to 14. Pass the turn. Makes a construct. Yep. Crack the uh, EE. You might file in something. That's not, doesn't have a color. You could what? From colors or from a color of your choice. Wow. That didn't work though. Makes a construct. Digs for something. Shadow Spear. He hits us for five. That's pretty good. Yep. 
take it. Oh my god, we have a what e hand e i hand iteration. Come on, give me something here. That just yeah, that just doesn't do anything. Yep, yeah, scoop it up. Yeah, that that was not a good start for us. Uh, I think I'm gonna go down the remands completely. Go up dress downs. I don't like that. Try them. Go planes. Esper Sentinel. Steam vents untapped. Steve. Uh, go cave. Sure. Goes to combat. Attacks. Block. Stack. Get an island. Bolt. Bolt. Yes, we will pay. Bye. Faster. Me lands. Stoneforge Mystic. That's not. That's actually not terrible, right? I'd rather see a Stoneforge than a Thalia. Calder complete, which basically means I'm killing it. And you're going to be stuck with the Calder complete for turns. That hitting us for the Esper Sentinel down to 17. Expressive iteration. Pay. Land. All right. So we put Spiral in hand. Chalice back. Tarn. Play that Tarn. We need a red source here. So regardless, I'm going down a... Mountain, so let's just take a basic mountain. Bolt the mystic past the turn. Sanctifier and back. Eats up all of our spells in the yard. Sure. Doesn't do anything other than that. But sure. No attacks. Passes. Escape shift. Interesting. We eat I uh will pay. If we find a two lands that would be ideal here. Sweet. So put Misty in hand, that back, put Forest. And since we've already paid for the one, this Growth Spiral is basically free. Play Misty, pass the turn. Stoneforge Mystic for the opponent. I don't think I crack the Misty this turn. Just take my beats and go down. It gives me the highest probability of finding another land this turn. All right, so we EE -E on two. We pay the one into Esper Sentinel. We go ahead and pop it. So he wants to fetch or it dies. Okay. Pass. Another Stoneforge Mystic. So persistent on getting down a Stoneforge. Gets a Lion Splat. Lion Lash. Shadow Spear. Hits us for one down to 12. Let's Joint Exploration. Dig two, scry one. Or draw one. We need to find a, a land or a bolt. Bottom, top. Play the trial. Crack that. Get a breeding pool? EE -E on one. Blow it up. Pass the turn. We top deck a fetch. That would be the best case. So that should be exactly enough to kill him. Because we need eight lands to win from here. Question is, can he beat me this turn? It's only five points of damage. It's us. Down to four. Pass the escape ship. Joint expiration. Need to find a land. Bottom. Top. There we go. And that's how you win a game of magic. Gape shift. Get more mountains into Valica. Save targets. All face. Always yes. Always yes. Always yield. Yes. Got it. And that so that's how you win a game of magic with Team Escape Shift right there, baby. Eats his germ token, gains seven. But I'm still doing enough to kill you still. Expedition map. Passes. Another shift. Play Valica. Go. Swampers. Call them familiar. Witches Oven. Got the cat assemble. Play the Triumph. I should have played that last turn. Just now seen that. Sacks it. Gets the cat back. There's the kitty cat again. Cracks the map. Get a Urborg. Urza Saga. Makes sense. Hits us. Down to 17. Passes. Steam vents. Untapped. Go. Sacks a cat. Brings back the said cat. Drains us. Untaps. Another Urza Saga. Hits us. Down to 13. Uh kicker bottom bottom uh trying to find lands all right we untap play scalding tarn crack the tarn get a breeding pool sapped play wren up to get back tarn go mix a construct sacks the cat brings back that sad cat we'll go ahead and bolt the construct what are you tutoring up another witch's oven that would make sense this looks this list probably gonna get a lot better when we get Diabolic Content, this this deck should just automatically just pick that card up. Probably going to make this deck a little bit, a lot stronger, actually. Having the Cat, the Oven, Asmoro, kills my Wren. Well, that was not polite. Drains us. I, was, I assume that's what occurred. And he hits us down to 8. E, EI, Joint Expiration. Put the Mountain back in. E A E I. I don't need it. I do need to get this ramp spell going. 
and dig for a land. I'm I'm two away. I think I have to pass. We're down to six. Oi. It's pretty rough right there. Makes another construct. This is a four four now. I think we're gonna die. I think we are going to die. Yeah, because this is right here is five. Yeah, so we scoop it up. I guess we bring in endurance. I don't know if Chalice on one gets around that in natural state over bolts. Dress down looks fine, but I guess reman is just actively worse than that. Run up like that. Play Misty. We have to play something we will, but otherwise we're going to try them. Thought seizes. Okay. Crack the Misty. Grab a Triome. Untap. Play Steve. Go. Kitty Cat. Sure. Crack Steve. I think we grab Island. Untap. Drill Land. That's pretty good. Expressive Iteration. Put Misty in hand. Fire back. Play that set. Valakut. Actually, I should have done that reverse. I should have put the Valakut in hand. Because then I could have Grow Spiraled. <laughs> and then put the Valakut into play. That would have ramped me off. Yeah. But I kind of want to leave up this natural state. So it's fine. It's fine. Liliana. We will pop the Urza Saga. Misty. Ugh. Hits us. Down to 17. Dryad. Play that set. Dryad. Play Steam Vents. Untapped. Ugh. Well, that sucked. Pass the turn. It's probably going to down to kill our Dryad. Yep. Called it. Now what do you got? Cycles. Street Wraith. Plays the Verti Catacombs. Cracks that set Verti Catacombs. Narcomentia. If he names Valica, I guess we don't necessarily need it. You could name Scapeshift here, though. That seems... Wish. He failed. Yeah. We're not Titan Shift. We're Teamer Valica. Or Teamer Shift. All right. Fire. The Liliana. Go. Mm, he milled and he drains us. Sure. Urza Saga. Yeah. Do I just want to draw here? What's Ice the Saga? Okay, that's a land. Please give me... Okay. Iteration. Put Spiral in hand. Spiral back. Exile Dryad. Play that said Dryad. Play Stomping Grounds. Shoot Face. In past the turn. Liliana. I Me, mean, when you get a down ticket. Yep. Hits us. Forest. Grow spiral. Alright. Endurance. Shuffle your library back in. Or your graveyard back in. That's Moro. Underworld cookbook. Inbound, potentially. Uh, block it. Didn't even sack it. Makes no sense. I think I have to cycle. I have two green, so I'm okay. I need I need scape shift. Dress down. See what he does. No witch. I, no witches of an activation. Cycles. Underworld cookbook. Dress down. Kill the construct. Okay. Cat comes back. <laughs> uh, I don't even care. I'll pitch it. No attacks. Passes. The breeding pool. That's whatever, I guess. That's the turn. There goes our endurance. Brings back the cat. Down to eight. It's for four. We need to find a scape ship now. Like, we, we we could win this game. Chalice. That doesn't do it. And we lose. One and one with the deck. Let's get into the next. Valica. Go. 
stomping grounds. So we draw our own stomping grounds, but we play forest. Tribelder. Bastard. Haggle. Violent Outburst. Creeping Chill. Interesting. Is he like a, a dredge style? Is he dredge like? Bastard. Oh, Wheel of Fate. Oh, that, that. I seen a deck like that with Shieldridge in it. That, 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 that is something. Final Outburst. Okay. Uh, Remand. I think I have to. Expressive Iteration. Grow Spiral? Misty. Play that said Misty. Passiturn. I guess I could have got the other card too. Shieldred, I bet. No, Haggle. Or the Merchant of the Veil. Yeah, that's fine. Crack the Misty. Grab a Breeding Pool. Pool. Untapped. Grow Spiral. Untapped. Dryad. Wren. Up to get back Misty. Play the Misty. Both fade. Pass the turn. Merchant of the Veil draws a card. Loots. Question is, can he kill my Dryad? I think we're in a very good position here, right? <laughs> so we crack the Misty. Grab a forest. Bolt the face. <laughs> and bolt the face. Face, untap, uptick, get back Misty, play that said Misty, bolt the face, grow spiral. Right, I guess I should have EI, but that's pretty good performance right there. Uh, I guess endurance, seems good. Dress down, out, bolt, chalice, down, bolt, run it like that. Stomping grounds, tapped. Aceturn. I'm confused. Didn't we win last game? Why are we on why are we on the play? Wheel of Fate suspended. Crack the tarn. Grab a breeding pool. Cast the instant speed joint. Well, that's kind of weird. I guess I could have got both. That works. Misty. Crack the misty. Uh grab a forest. Dryad. Triumph. Go. Charlotte's agent. Gets himself. We're gonna see it. Wheel of Fate. Uh, no dredgers. He had no dredgers. Sweet. Good for us. Lucky enough for us, we didn't have any lands in hand. He drew us into a scape shift. That's pretty good. So we play tap land, play mountain, ship it. <coughs> uh, attack. <coughs> uh, he needs to beat us this turn, doesn't he? I think we, we have six lands breaking. Ironically, if he would have targeted me, it probably would have destroyed me because I only have so many lands. I think I want to bottom both. I need the mountains and the deck. Gape shift. Eat up all the lands. Got it. Two and one with the deck. Let's get into the wrap up. So what did we learn this week about Teamer Scape Shift? The deck felt great. I enjoyed every minute of it. And I think the deck is pretty dang awesome overall. I love a, I love the slight tempo-ish control aspects of the deck. And the combo finisher is normally how I like to play my, you know, my uh controller shell, my control is shells. Uh the only thing that I think I might I might want to uh, that I probably should do is probably go down a joint exploration and maybe up a ren. Seems like a pretty you know. Solid move overall. If there's something that you guys would have considered, let me know down in the comments. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell notification, and don't forget to look in the description for the the link to the deck list and the link to my Discord. Join it. So until next time, hope you guys have a great rest of your day.